I'm Christy Neal with Nashville Computer. I am Business Development Manager here. And what are QR codes and are they safe for you? First of all, QR codes stand for Quick Response Codes. Maybe you've seen them on retail items such as this bag of Starbucks coffee. And the cool thing about this one, when I click this QR code, it takes me to a video and shows me how to make coffee. QR codes can be used for many different types of advertising and marketing. Another item here, some people actually put them on t-shirts that directs them to possibly a marketing or advertising bit about that specific company. Recently, there was an antivirus company that did an article about the very first virus downloaded via a QR code. Now, it wasn't actually downloaded through the scan, but when the app was set to download, that is when the virus came upon the phone. Um, through the texting function, it took over and sent out multiple texts and to some very expensive texting locations. Then the user, um, unknowingly, was billed this large amount for these texts, these different sites. So, are these safe for you? I would say if you know the party to whom the QR code belongs, such as the Starbucks coffee, or possibly being at a hotel. Recently, I was at a hotel checking in, looked down on the mat and noticed a QR code. So I took my phone, um, and the QR code application simply uses your camera to scan the code. And when I scanned the mat at the hotel desk, it offered a discount for the hotel. Now that was a safe QR code because I knew it was a reliable source. So to scan or not to scan is the question. I would say if you know the source, such as the hotel or the bag of coffee, that's safe. If you're walking down the street and you see a random QR code on a pole or a sign or a mailbox, not safe because you don't know who the source is. So be careful when you're scanning. And don't forget to call Nashville Computer for all of your IT needs.